Hey, this is Coach Joe Hafner, and in today's video, Coach Jim Huber is going to explain to you why every single player should be practicing post play, and why even elite guards like Russell Westbrook have been working on their game in the post. After that, you'll learn the three C's of post play, and how this will improve your post play so you can score more points around the basket. So now we're going to get into how to be effective in the post, and I think, I don't care if you're a guard, if you're a big, if you're a wing, whatever you play, you need to understand how to play a little bit your back to the basket. You'll see now, like Oklahoma City Thunder, they, Billy Donovan, when he went and coached there, he started taking Russell Westbrook and he inverted him in the post because of his strength and his size to be able to punish smaller people guarding him. So you're going to have coaches that might look at mismatches and try to take advantage of your size, even if you're a point guard. So a couple things we need to think about is this. We, we talk to our individuals in the in the post first thing if I came across the lane and I was going across maybe somebody said a flex screen or like a, a cross screen for me and I'm coming across we talk about stopping at the rim first stopping at the rim showing our hands because we'd like to catch a little two footer right here right don't overrun a layup but we got one 1002 if we can't get it here now we're sprinting outside the lane and we don't want to get called for a three second call right Okay, but the biggest thing you understand when you come out in the post, do not straddle the block and don't be right at the block because now if I catch it and I pivot baseline, now I got a backboard, it's almost like a, a, another defender, right? I have no angles. So we want to talk about straddling the first hash, the first hash right here, splitting it. So if I pivot and face, I got angles and I got, I got areas to move and space to create and do stuff off of, okay? So that's the first thing. Now, when I catch the basketball, a couple things in the post. The ball is thrown, you're just gonna sometimes get a bad pass. You gotta leave position to gain possession, right? You gotta make sure you understand that as well. I catch the basketball, when you catch it, here's what I want you to think about. We call about the three C's. First, I wanna catch it, right? Get it with two hands and catch it. And we talk about the second C, I wanna chin it. Chin it, be tight with the basketball. Cause you're gonna have people coming in, digging down, trying to come in and dig the basketball out, right? A lot of smaller people, so I'm gonna chin the basketball. And then we talk about the third C is check. I wanna check. Don't look, I'm not a big believer in looking in the corner, look baseline. I look to, like, like to look check middle, because I can see three-fourths of floor double teams coming. If I need to back dribble out of it, space, and play out of it.